Born on December 4th, charming, handsome, a father, a top real estate agent. Well, enough about me, we're here to talk about Poppy. I keep thinking about <clears throat> our current world and how, honestly, we all know Poppy wouldn't fit in. He was one of a kind, his unapologetic, tell it like it is attitude was loved by everyone. This is like 30 times. <laughs> uh, but it caught you off guard sometimes. <clears throat> Years ago, we had a birthday dinner for my sister <clears throat> at our house. <clears throat> some water? I don't know. No? Okay. <clears throat> Sorry. Um, for my sister, and she had invited over one of her boyfriends. Uh, Poppy walks in 20 minutes late, as usual. And Ashley introduces Poppy to her friend, and Poppy, who was sitting in, the family, <coughs> in a chair in the family room. Poppy says, nice to meet you. Are you Jewish? We all start looking at each other, like, where is this going? So the guy says, uh, what? Poppy says louder, are you Jewish? He says, no, why? He says, well, why do you have your hat on inside? <laughs> so we all just shook our heads. Another time, Aunt Nancy had a boyfriend over for a family party on the back deck at Ray Court. And she says, Daddy, Mike thinks mayo on tomatoes is weird. Poppy looks him dead in the eye and says, get out. <laughs> of course, we were all quiet because he said it's so serious. Or that time he told that agent in his office to pack up his desk because real estate just wasn't the job for him, which would be an HR nightmare in today's climate. When I started in real estate, an office manager in my company called me and said Poppy was the reason <clears throat> that he was still in real estate. <clears throat> he had a great first year, but the next year he struggled. Poppy sat him down, told him to get his shit together or he wasn't going to make it. Poppy always had a way with words. He'd tell you, <clears throat> he'd tell you his thoughts and he'd sit there with a smile and chuckle to himself. Sometimes we say, hey, Poppy, I don't think you're allowed to do that. And he'd respond with, I'm the Poppy. I can do whatever I want, which always delighted the nurses. <laughs> so we always remember Poppy's love for LL Cool J and Ice-T, the rapper and actor, not the drink, which I'm sure we all still wonder how that happened. Gone but never forgotten. We will always carry memories for us. <clears throat> See you in the great brokerage in the sky.